when the, the rain is going to arrive. <laughs> All right, Dave, and that siren is going because they're practicing for severe weather, and we know this is Severe Weather Awareness Week, so we are on top of it, and we are looking at temperatures warm enough to give us those thunderstorms. We've had a few spots through lower Michigan with a little rumble here and there, but the warm, windy conditions continue for the evening. More rain on the way, and the rain tomorrow night into Friday looks to be heavy, about an inch to an inch and a half. We haven't had that kind of rainfall for months, of course. We've had the snow, but as far as heavy rainfall, it's been back towards September. 71, our temperature, our high today, fourth time we've reached 70 degrees just this month, so we've had some warm weather. Cold front coming through, and that is bringing in the south winds out ahead of it and the warm air, but it has been very gusty. As far as rainfall is concerned, most of it north of M59 in spots. This is not by any means anything widespread, but we are seeing just a few clusters from time to time. Even some of that uh, thunder and lightning around Saginaw up toward Bad Axe now beginning to lift over the lake at this point. 67 degrees in Howell, 70 downtown, 68 degrees in Ann Arbor, and again, we hit 71 for a high, so over 20 degrees above average today. But winds are gusty still, 36 mile per hour wind gusts downtown, 35 in Ann Arbor, close to 30 in Pontiac. This continues for a couple more hours. I think those will start to die down, drop off after about eight o'clock. Cooler air behind the cold front. We know this happens this time of the year. It's not going to be a shock to the system, but we're going to notice it in the coming days. Temperatures tonight dropping into the 50s after midnight, but still pretty mild. Hour by hour forecast, we see the rain lifting through tomorrow. A few showers possible in the afternoon, but heavier rain arriving after 5 p.m. The heaviest of the rain likely overnight Thursday into early Friday. I think this rain will really start to wrap up around around noon on Friday. So the afternoon on Friday, a little gusty, but at least it'll be drier. Looking at some of the rainfall amounts from Thursday night into Friday morning, an inch to an inch and a half possible. So we'll be watching that. Could see some localized flooding concerns. 49 degrees, the low tonight, we're up to 63. So not bad, above average tomorrow. Cooling off for the weekend, more rain Saturday afternoon. Looks dry on Sunday. More 7 Action News ahead.